welcome to London. Welcome to the History Lord Channel. You join us here in St Thomas's Hospital and today we're going to pay tribute to this lady. This is Mary Seacole. She's a contemporary of Florence Nightingale. Now we did a video about Florence Nightingale very early on in this channel's history. She was born Mary Jane Grant in 1805 in Kingston, Jamaica to a Scottish army officer and a mixed race boarding house owner. She went on to marry one of the residents of that boarding house, Edwin Seacole. She was soon widowed and that was during a cholera and yellow fever epidemic. She then started training as a nurse and she specialised in herbal remedies that she learnt from her mother. Well, she came to the United Kingdom and she wasn't selected to go to the Crimea with Florence Nightingale, so she created her own British hospital behind the enemy lines and she catered for the British soldiers there. When she returned to London in 1857, she was financially embarrassed, as the phrase was back then, and she wrote an open letter to Punch magazine and they said she was living in a poor room in Soho Square. In fact, there's a blue plaque to commemorate that at number 14 Soho Square to this day. Thankfully, this triggered sales in her autobiography, The Wonderful Adventures of Mrs. Seacole in Many Lands. And that was her upturn. She was able to afford a nicer house in Paddington, where she ended her days in 1881. Now, this particular statue was unveiled 135 years after her death in 2016. And I'd like to end by giving a quote uh, from a newspaper article in the Times of 1857. And it goes like this. I trust that England will not forget one who nursed her sick, who sought out her wounded to aid and succour them, and who performed the last offices for some of her illustrious dead. I think very fitting words for a, an unsung hero until quite recently a contemporary of Florence Nightingale, who incidentally has a museum in St Thomas's Hospital. Thank you very much for watching today. If you have enjoyed the video, then please do hit subscribe. And if you want to know when videos are uploaded, there's a little notification bell just down below. And if you want to see what we do outside of these videos, then please go to historylord.co.uk and find out about our walking tours of London. And if you want to see what James does outside of filming in these uh, wonderful videos, then please go to the link below and see James's website and YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you very soon.